ladies and gentlemen, America's ambassadors in blue, the United States Air Force Thunderbirds. One of the most universal Indian legends is that of the Thunderbird, a great and invincible power that flew from heavenly heights. Its flashing eyes and thunderous speed warded off danger. The legend lives. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Your United States Air Force Thunderbirds are extremely pleased to be with you today. You see the Thunderbird maintenance crews and Thunderbird pilots beginning their march out to their respective aircraft. And we sincerely hope that you will enjoy today's demonstration. You see positioned before you the pilots, maintenance crews, and six F-16s to be used in today's demonstration. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's begin the flying demonstration. These men train extremely hard to perfect their combat flying skills in the world's most advanced fighters. They're here today to show Americans like yourself what their skill and courage behind an incredible performer like the F-16 Falcon means to America. Let's check it out firsthand and go for a high-powered ride. Thunderbird, check two, three, four, five, six. Let's run them up. At this point, these aircraft are generating more than 100,000 pounds of thrust. Clear now. beautiful. But keep in mind behind the beauty of each maneuver. Check on the roll. The Thunderbird pilots are constantly executing the diverse and intricate combat flying skills taught to all Air Force pilots during their training. of the diamond formation, providing an excellent angle for photographs. Thunderbird 
six will now demonstrate the rapid roll capability of the F-16. His roll rate will exceed 300 degrees per second. Now, Thunderbird 6 with four maximum performance aileron rolls. Approaching from your left is the Arrowhead formation. Watch as the Thunderbirds arc through the sky, much like the path of an arrow. The Thunderbirds and the Arrowhead roll. Into the float. Look off ready now. The solo pilots are entering to perform opposing four-point rolls. At show center, each pilot will complete a 360-degree roll, stopping precisely at each 90-degree point. the diamond formation approaching for the diamond roll. Watch the ballet-like precision as each wingman maintains perfect position on the leader. The graceful diamond roll. directly ahead and you will see the two solos approaching for the crossover break. And now, the breathtaking crossover break. <laughs> to your right, the Thunderbirds are now in trail formation. It is a difficult maneuver to fly as any movement ripples down the formation. During the pull, the leader will call for a change into the diamond. The wingman and slot pilot will then move swiftly and smoothly to their diamond positions. Diamond ready now. Precision flying and the admiring crowd is a large, talented core of specialists and support people who keep the pilots and planes performing on time. In fact, in their more than 30 year history, the remarkable Thunderbird support crews have kept pilots and planes performing at nearly 100 air shows annually. Not to mention the 100,000 miles plus of travel between show sites. Without cancellation or curtailment of a single air show due to maintenance difficulties. Call it what you will. Dedication, skill, teamwork, esprit de corps, or attention to detail. They all fit. It's why any team member will tell you. Once a Thunderbird, always a Thunderbird. Thunderbird 5 has just demonstrated tactical surprise. The ability of a small, extremely maneuverable fighter to enter a target area undetected and safely exit at high speed. Now, look to your right to see the Thunderbird Diamond with gear and flaps extended as they slow to landing speed. They will fly the length of the demonstration area. So Can you see Solo diving on the far horizon in hot pursuit of the Diamond? Though it's hard to detect Solo's profile, he's there, and coming at a closure rate in excess of 10 miles per minute. This challenge? Catch the diamond right here at Show Center. Impossible? Let's see. 1,000. 1,000. Show Center. 
Solo was now pulling five times his body weight in G-Force, and yet under such pressure he must precisely execute complex and ever-changing angles and air speeds to overtake and slide smoothly into formation with the diamond. The Thunderbird air demonstration is designed to test men and aircraft to the upper limits of their capacities. You might call it a proficiency test of the red, white, and blue. Let's watch several key moments that further demonstrate the proficiency of these men and their advanced aircraft. Max turn. Solo enters show center and banking sharply, executes a high G turn of 360 degrees with a radius barely wider than three and a half football fields. A demonstration of why the F-16 is considered the world's most maneuverable fighter. from the opposite direction, making the same maneuver. Only this time, with an added dimension. A wingtip to wingtip formation. To sustain a precision formation while in a continuous high G force requires exceptional pilot physical condition, coordination, and proficiency. Thunderbird 6 enters again to perform the maximum climb. In seconds, the F-16 climbs from ground level to over 12,000 feet, demonstrating the tremendous thrust and rolling rate of the F-16. Combining all the skills and performance into one sensational finale. The Thunderbird's most popular maneuver, the bomb burst to the crossover. There's more. Stand by brakes. A split penny now, smoke. And oh. Right on the line. Converging from the four points of the compass at a closure rate nearing 1,000 miles per hour, each of the four pilots must continuously and accurately compensate for winds and relative position by changing airspeed and direction as needed. Five seconds. Is that what I do? Three or three. Got you one. The difficult, made to look easy. Another good one complete. This man and his team are tired but happy. However, their day probably isn't complete. To quote another American of kindred spirit, but I have promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep. And so a brief rest before off to tomorrow's show site. There you go. Late as it is, there's time for one more pass. This one's special. A salute from all Thunderbirds, past and present, to the land they love and serve so proudly.